Okay, well, final two minutes with the Chicago Bears at Buffalo Bills. This is absolutely terrible. Absolutely terrible. 41 to 9, the Bears lead the Bills. And you're going up against the tight end, so you got to understand, and, and that's just... Like, um, holy shit, this is terrible. <laughs> it's got to be better than that. you got a defensive end coming in, and you kind of were... Next week, for Veterans Day, uh, the Bills will go take on the New York Jets. ...for Chris Ivory and obviously out the remainder of the game, as the Bears defense does its job, and so they can kneel... Down to a knee, run the clock off. Thank God. Just get this and shit over the with. Of the Bears, it was old school the way they took over this with the Eddie Jackson fumble return. I... For Buffalo sports fans, tonight the Sabres will be taking on the New York Rangers tonight at 7. After yesterday when the Sabres had a 9-2 win over Ottawa. At least we can fall back on them a bit this year. All right, well, they're running the clock out. They're what? They're running out the clock. Oh, yeah. All right. The Bears go to five and three. The Bills drop to two and seven. Keep in mind, last year the Bills were nine and seven, and they already have seven losses. Holy shit. When are they going to be officially eliminated from playoff contention? The Bills. I'm going to a Bills game on the 25th of this month when they play the Jaguars. I'll be in the, I'll be in the Pepsi suite. I know they're shit, but experience is nice regardless. So, this is just... Oh my god. Uh, the Saints and the Rams will be facing off. That'll probably be the one I watch. That's a that'll be a great game. And tonight the Packers and the Patriots. Another great game.